Okay, I think it should be up. Hopefully everything's like, you know, running effectively. The bars are moving. Or at least the mic bar is moving, so... I think it should be fine. Bonus James Bond stream, so... We were talking about it through, if for those that missed it. From Russia with Love, we finished that. Figured we'd do Bloodstone, was talking about it, and... We'll get it out of the way. So, I have it running. Hopefully it will run effectively. We don't get any weird crashing. Like we did with with everything or nothing or from Russia with love, but I mean, we're not playing this on the Xbox though. So this one's gonna be an interesting one though because this is from a developer that I liked, Bizarre Creations, because you may know them from the Project Gotham Racing series. So this was their last game. So and I liked them, and this was the last one, and then they got shut down. Well talk a little bit about that after after we're done or at least run in the stream because i feel like it's something worth discussing a bit but let's load this up let me load up this game <coughs> and we'll see if it works And yes, this one was published by Activision. This is when they had the game bomb license for a bit. It's our creations. Yeah. Okay, hang on. So I did do a little testing quickly, but we're gonna have to adjust some stuff. So it looks like I may have to make some adjustments. I was just running it in windowed mode for now. Okay. I have to figure out something, so, because it's causing some issues. I like how it just restarted. Sorry about that, guys. Well, sorry about that. Let's run with this then. Let us see if this actually works. Hello 7, this is urgent. Priority 1. We fear the attack may be imminent. How long until you're on the ground? We should be down in 10 minutes. We haven't got 10 minutes. The satellite is picking up suspicious activity near Greco's boat. You've got to get a move on now. I'm on my way. Change of plans. Head for the harbor. All right, I guess. Things don't always go to plan. Hi, Shinky, how are you? Sources, General. 
Grego has flown in a group of international terrorists for a suicide mission. The plan is for the attack to coincide with the moment they take the group photograph. I can't much care what your sources tell you, Em. We've checked Greco out. He is an international business. How are you doing, though, dude? Here on vacation. His Just got home from work. How was your shift? international arms trading. He'd like to see all the heads of state, all the members of the G20, wiped out in one fell swoop. Is that what your sources are telling you? Or is it your female intuition? I'll thank you to keep my intuition out of this, General. I want you to cancel the photo op now. Impossible. Well, that was a weird glitch. have to have some faith. Ordering food, what are you having? My ability to protect them. You can keep your faith. I put my trust in Bond. Bond. The one James Bond. Or the McBond, right? Oh no, how's it looking? Everything looking and sounding fine? adjustments quickly here yeah if you're noticing it please let me know so i can fix it up okay nothing to at least that's a radio good thing shows your landing has gone undetected Blueprints show Greco's quarters is this a PC game? The this is available on the PC, the 360, and the PS3. But this game came out back in 2010. So needless to say, it's pretty old. Just need to wait for Gregor's word, then get the job done. Where are our escorts? They should have been here by now. Get some kind of help. I think we're meeting us on the way. I heard Greco on the phone. They better show up. We can't do this alone. Don't worry. Greco will take care of it. In the meantime, I want to get back to the news. Make sure everything else is still on track. Are you getting this? They're saying it's going to be historic. Not long until they find out how right they are. At least the summit will go stop in it. There we go. Of the heavy handed tactics employed by the Hellenic police service in the weeks leading up to today's events. Where is my helicopter? Where are my boats? Maybe you think we should just. Maybe we should just wait. Let him finish his conversation, right? you have any idea of what is at stake if this mission fails? Give me one single reason why I should not have you killed. Easy, because I'm gonna kill you first. Who the hell are you? But you know, we were doing some technical stuff It's over. at the start of this. I don't think so. Guts! There we go. Yeah, no, I dug through a couple of James Bond movies, so... But I need to get the last um, Daniel Craig one. Then I'll own all the Daniel Craig ones. Also, Shinky. Give me that. We may be doing a GoldenEye no. playthrough. It's Don't going to depend on one thing because... Have you heard what's happened recently about GoldenEye? Helix 
Just looking for the cancel 360 port. That's not canceled. That is an actual Xbox version that is coming, and it's probably going to be for the X. It's a new Xbox version that's coming out. There was a tweet I saw about it from Wario 64 that should still be up, so theoretically, there could be a re release of GoldenEye coming. And if so, I think we'll add that I'll be adding that to the list. Because it was either play that or do GoldenEye Reloaded, or maybe we'll do both and do the same idea as like Twin Snakes. Like, not a good one. I only tried the multiplayer for like a little bit, but I played more Perfect Dark back in the day. So, playing both those GoldenEye games are going to be... are going to be first time playthroughs. One bullet did that much damage. So, we could hear something about, about it. If that is true... If that is true... I think Bond will probably still continue. We've wasted enough time. I'd be Get excited moving. to do it. Yeah, we're just gonna crash this boat, probably. Yep, there's a... Yep, of course. And he jumps out with grace. What was your favorite thing about the N64 game, though, that you remember? Do we? I don't think so, Greco. They don't know. Mark an execution. Four player deathmatch. What were the best weapons to use? I know there were some hot takes with some of the weapons in that game, right? Third Glockage. Hopefully I read that name right. Hello, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? And how is he not, you know, crumpled from that? He took it like a freaking champ. The bomb, Greco? That'd be one thing I'd be curious to see Last with Where is it? with that, if it is true. If the there's online multiplayer and if it's crossplay. You're too late. This guy shake my head. Hey, don't worry. You know, all I ask, be respectful in chat. 
Nothing crazy and all that. I understand why some would do it, but we haven't had any problems here, so we'd be respectful. You don't pronounce it right. You watch Naruto? Sadly, no. It is an anime that has escaped me. I do have Naruto games, though, that I need to try. Car, get out of my way. Evil. Why do you say that? What? Is that bad? He finds where you live and starts busting kneecaps. That's what Shinky does, so you might want to be careful about that. Third. Fear. You will have another opportunity. I'm sure of it. But hopefully we can help brighten up your mood. How are you doing, buddy? But, sir, thank you for that follow. I appreciate it. You're now on the phone. Welcome to the club. I'm glad to have you here, and I hope you enjoy your stay. It's finals, though. Well, hopefully you still pass your class. I hope you still pass your class, people. Fireworks? Did you know there were going to be fireworks? Honestly? Yes. yes. <laughs> How did you know? Continue studying. Well, hey, hopefully... Hopefully I can keep you entertained. I'll say that fear. But how have you been? And third, how are you doing tonight? A little bit of everywhere. Well, I appreciate you coming by. Nice to see you. Darcy. Thank you for coming by to this place. I Hopefully, I can keep you entertained. Well, that makes two of us. Well done. What do you do on Thank Twitch, you. if you don't mind me asking? May are you, you a viewer, or do you yes, stream as well? Yes, I'll have a neat. And what can I provide for the gentleman? I'll have. You'll have a vodka martini. Shaken or stirred? I see you're streaming the Hot Cheetos Discord, so why not? Ah, Cheeto, that lovely man. I haven't talked to him in a little bit. I need to see how that guy's how that guy's been doing. It has been a little while, I'll say that. Are you familiar with James Bond, though, third? But no, Shinky, what are you, what did you order for food? Nope, this is just the intro. It's just like with the James Bond movies. They start with like a little opening sequence and then it goes into the introduction, as you could see right here. Of course, you must have that pineapple on the pizza. People streams, it's rude. Lovely. Hey, you don't have to, it's okay. I just asked the question, so it's up to you if you want to talk about it. Good. Okay, there we go. There you go, Sean. I hope you're happy about that. <laughs> Back into it like two weeks. Nice. Well, I'll have to make sure to check out your stuff then. I hope you enjoy the game. I appreciate your lurk, Spicy. How are you doing, dude? How was your stream last night? Good morning, 007. I know we promised you a week's well, third here. for Admirals, but we have a situation developing that requires immediate attention. Are you free to speak? I'll yes, give you a follow. -up. I'm in a hotel. I should be online in a moment. Are you playing with the wife? There you are. How much do you know about Midhurst laboratories? Biotech firm, publicly traded, City of London, military. Sean, how are you doing? Not just any military contractor. Two years ago, Midhurst Laboratories signed a contract for some mission critical biotech. And how go the games of Fortnite, though, Spicy? That's so secret, I'm loath to discuss it even on this link. 
Oh, well, I hope I hope Tito's doing okay. I should get in touch with him, Last like I said again. Last week, one of their senior researchers, Malcolm Tedworth, went missing from his yacht in the English Channel. At first, the Royal Navy presumed he was dead. His boat was discovered capsized after a squall off the coast. But this morning, we received. A well, we're doing a bonus survive. game, so we we're going to be doing. So we're going to do this. However, we have heard that a golden eye, a golden eye remaster will be coming Soon out. After, if it does come out, we'll be extending Bond's, near a construction Bond's duties again, and we will play through GoldenEye. And we'll probably do GoldenEye Reloaded as well and do the same thing as trap. we did with Metal Gear Solid and the Twin Any Snakes. We'll play both. Himself, hang of conscience, second thoughts about selling out the UK. That's why the helicopter is landing outside duties, the I know you have to do your duty. There'll be a jet waiting at the airport. And when you arrive in Istanbul, do whatever you have to, by any means necessary, to find out who's behind this. And make sure that research doesn't fall into the wrong hands. <laughs> you know, that's the only reason I would probably play it too spicy, since there's the no building mode. It makes it worth playing, I would say. It pretty much changes the game, the feel of the game, I think. But yeah, Sean, we're going to see how things go with this. Good morning, 007. We located the cell phone that the Echelon system found. So we may do some more. Ancient catacomb beneath this construction site. We lost the signal. Oh, we'll find out. Ground, but may be able to pick it we'll have to find out what happens this week. Q branch and transmission. But who here has played Bloodstone before? Do you play Fortnite yourself as well, third? You! Stop! Where do you think you're going? Dr. Bond. British Museum. Architectural Heritage Foundation. Here to study your preservation efforts. Nah. You can call the Turkish Ministry of Culture. I don't care. Nobody goes down there. Without a hard hat. Of course. Of course. <laughs> Safety no. Test. It's like, hard hat. Who needs that? This construction site marks the point we lost Tedworth's signal. We need to find out if he's still friendly or working with our enemies. Use your smartphone to search for evidence. Ben, would you consider PS3 retro? I would say it's two generations old. I would say it's pretty close. I would say it's pretty close to it. I don't know. What would you guys say? It is becoming retro. But both 360 PS3. Drive, it on same with Continue Wii. Searching the area. And it looks like the other one was right here. Dr. Bond, the foreman is ready to meet you. Please wait for him in the far cabin. Come this way. Obviously, this is going to be a trap. It is almost 20 years old. Well, yeah. It is getting to that point. I mean, I consider Xbox, PS2, and GameCube retro. Same thing with Game Boy Advance and DS. Would you consider 3DS retro as well? Same with Vita. So you're just going to have a camera that's just focused on your bum? Is that the idea, Shinky? We need to get the hell out of here. Has a tendency to zoom in on asses. No. 
There we go. I forgot, did it ever zoom in on Miracle? Everybody's fair game, including the main character. Oh, this is just a dead end. Never mind. Mostly Raimi, though. Take him down. Wait, where is he? You ain't getting back up because you dead. There we go. There's some other things. So definitely we'll be looking out for you. Thanks for the time. Take care of yourself. Have fun out there. And hopefully I'll get to see you again third. But I appreciate you coming by. Take care of yourself. Mostly Raimi. Kinda. Okay, let's see. Now, I have heard this game is supposed to be short. So we'll see. Their aim is not great, is it? That should not have connected, but okay. There we go. Okay, no, I had to check.
Oh, I thought that took him out. I guess not. There we go. Explosives for the win. Oh, here it is. There we go. Okay, that was worth it. Is it critical? Here, just a minute, I need to scan this. There we go. Well, do you have to? Ha you're 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 not going to need a crash counter, right, for playing Star Ocean this time. Four stable, three is the only really bad one, so I have to keep that in mind when I play it, right? Okay, here we go. Okay, so no putting the map at full screen. Pretty much save at every checkpoint. At every save point you can find, right? Excuse me while I have my bond vision. Tanner, I'm in the catacombs. See if you can patch me into Tedworth's signal. Got it. Bring up your phone and it will give you Tedworth's position. Should lead you right to him. Oh, of course. We need to leave. While this thing starts up. Come on, James. Okay, we're safe. I'm in the inner chamber. Structures holding. Some rubble has come down, but otherwise it's dead in here. What body? It would be nice if they announced second the PS4 version of Second Evolution to come out. Do you think so?
Okay then. Really? Come on, pop out. They need to redo that port. Wasn't that the same thing with uh, the first one? I'm being shot at. There we go. Or did they put more effort into that? Maybe it's time they go back and look at that version and fix it. Come on, Pedward, on your feet. You're wasting your time. I'm not gonna tell him anything. We'll see about that. Now move. Come here. Closer, closer, thank you. Yeah, just walk into that. Thank you. Help me. Help me. Help me. Here, this way. All right, I guess I'll save you. Who did this to you? Bernin. His name is Bernin. He wanted my research. My formulas. For bioweapons. We've got to get you out of here. I'll never make it. The only way is to climb out. But it's not too late. Maybe you can still save... Tedworth. All right. Yep, this way. Okay, we gotta get up there somehow. Yeah, because again, the yeah, door's locked. Okay, yeah. I guess this was the only way. Add a new character art done by the artist of Star Ocean 4. Full Japanese. Yeah, I did see... I did think that was a nice touch. Because it seemed like you gave parts of, like, the last Hopi International version. On PS4, yet. So, when Limited Run did their announcements today, which, if you haven't checked them out, they actually put out quite a few good things that are coming. That physical release for Shantae is going over pre-order August 20... in the end of August, so August 26th, I believe it is? So I want to say around that time. Yeah, so I want to say around that time, or maybe even a little bit before then.
Well, that has good range. Really, bullet damage is a little inconsistent. I do know there is somebody else in here. Oh, there. Anybody else? I guess we need to go up. Just flop over. Okay, there it is. There we go. Now I need to get a new weapon. There we go. Yeah, because I need to pre-order that copy of Shantae. I like your grenade launcher, but I'm gonna stick with this. Tanner, what do we have on a man named Burnin? Hold on, I'm doing a search. Here Uncharted with more gadgets. Burnin. Low level gangster, a middleman. If he's got it's way more shooter search, heavy though. He probably won't be holding onto it for long. I don't like the sound of that. What is the password for the USB drive? Tell me the key to crack the code. Stop. Stop. I'll tell you. Thank you. Kill him. Let's get out of here. Oh, we need that key. We need that USB now. Let's go. I'm late for the handoff. He's here. Let's move. There isn't much for gadgets, I would say. It's just more like using your phone to check stuff out. Ooh, an Aston Martin. An older Aston Martin. Let's go for a drive, shall we? On to MI6. Ted was dead. Burning's on the move. Do you have him on satellite? Confirm 007. We're tracking him. Let us know if you lose visual contact. We'll do. 
I'm losing visual contact because of a fucking taxi. Yep. So that just screwed me over. I guess I gotta make their money somehow, right? Yeah, I don't have time for your bullshit. Yeah, the driving seems okay, though. Yeah, I'm just gonna stay with this thing, thank you. He's pulling a U-turn in the tunnel. Where's he heading? He seems to be going for the docks, 007. Stay with him. We can't lose those documents. Of course, these things are gonna make it difficult. Can't be as bad as Halo driving. Well, it's a little bit bad, but the, the thing that makes me sad is that, again, this is Bizarre Creations, the guys who did Project Gotham Racing. Like, the driving is still fine, it feels a little floaty, though, compared to PGR. Oh, shit. Of course they're gonna shoot at me. Oh, that's just funny. You're going to start me all the way back here. Hey, at least we drove into that thing with grace, right? At least we don't have to worry about, like, shooting, so. And if anything, the shooting just seems like it's auto-targeting for us, so. You know, dude, I'm like right behind you. You could just technically shoot this car, right? Thank you for letting me pass, by the way. Although I will say I prefer the driving in this compared to the last couple James Bond games. Seriously, you squished me. So I'm going to assume that is supposed to happen.
Yes, okay, that is supposed to happen. Well, we wrecked the car. Make sure he's dead. I'm going to make the handoff. Yay, let's go shoot more people. Bond, can you hear me? Come in, 007. Again, just want to use all the weapons. I have to try them at least once, right? Let's see how the shotgun is. Okay. Hey, will you guys slow down? I just want to talk. Not feeling it. No, yeah, take a break then. Nothing wrong with that. You can just hang out and just watch and, you know, watch me try to be a good secret agent. You have the high ground. Sure you do. Look at where that got you. It's over odd oh, job. I have the high ground. Sure you do. Ooh. We all know what happened to oh, odd job after that, right? I don't think your handoff's gonna go as well as you want it to. Stand still, please. I just need to shoot you. Physics. Excuse me, sir. Have you heard of my lord and savior, the MP5? He's great, isn't he? Oh, yeah. There it is. Now excuse me while I go introduce him to your friends here. Oh, chopper. Thank you for waiting.
This has got to be tougher on higher on the higher difficulty, I think. Hi there. Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna need to scan your helicopter. Thank you. Oh, wow, screen shake. I forgot I, I didn't. Yeah, that's not how this works, dude. I want a name. Who are you working for? Never. Let's try that again. Who is it? Who hired you? Give me the name. Pomerov. Stefan Pomerov. And where's he taking those papers? I don't know. I've told you everything I know. Please. Please, let me go. I'm no good to you anymore. That's true. You got that right. What is it, W7? Did you intercept the research? No, the researcher is dead. But I've got the name of the buyer. Go on. Pomerov. Stefan Pomerov. I've got him. Russian businessman. Nothing flagged, no police record. No unusual connections. According to the immigration data, he's in Monaco, due to leave on a flight to Moscow tonight. I'm sending you his picture and file. All right, so I guess we go up chasing it. after another Let's person. Let's get in touch with our best contact in Monaco. I'm bringing up the list now. See if he can stall Pomerov from leaving and have him meet me at the airport. Of course. Good. I'll be on the next flight out. Oops, sorry. James. I almost didn't recognize you. I'm sorry, have we met before? I think once, something in England. Nicole Hunter. My friends call me Nikki. Nicole Hunter? You're the jewelry designer. I've been called worse. It girl, socialite. Well, it's nice to see you, Nicole. I'm sure you've got a plane to catch. Actually, M sent me. Interesting cover. But not an unpleasant surprise. Should we go? Okay. The car's over there. I guess this is our Bond girl then, right? Nice car. It's a friend's. Would you like to drive? I feel much safer with a man behind the wheel. Oh dear. Oh dear. Do I have to drive this sequence? Oh, so okay. What can you tell me about Pomerov? Oh, he's such a lech. But he's kind of sweet, your basic Russian oligarch. He owns oil wells, diamond mines, and his own 737 with gold-plated fittings, of course. How do you know him? Sweetie. There are only six people worth dating in the world, and I've probably gone out with half of them. Turn here. Okay. 
The truth is, he supplies the chemicals used to alloy the gold and silver in my line of jewellery. And he's been after me to open a boutique in the casino he just bought in Monaco. He bought the casino? Mm-hmm. Another trinket on the must-have list for oligarchs. After a supermodel wife. So, I got him to delay his flight back to Siberia. That's where he keeps the wife at his headquarters, so she can't spend all his money. And we're going to meet in the boardroom, which should give you enough time to get into his office and break into his safe. Well done. So how did you... End up in bed with MI6? Well, that's one way of putting it. Mm -hmm. Darling, it's the perfect cover. Fashion shows, photo shoots, store openings. I get to travel the whole world, and nobody pays any attention. Emma approached you? Not exactly. Well, how not exactly? Well... There was this little tax, tax problem. problem. A, few years ago. a little tax problem. Yeah. And a small customs problem involving some diamonds. But that's how a girl from the society pages ends up working for MI6. Yes, James. But believe me, when necessary, I can be very discreet. You can drop me off in front of the casino. I'm sure you could be discreet. I'm going to put on my war paint before the meeting. I'll text you on the cell phone to let you know when we're almost finished. All right, let's see where this goes now, shall we? Provided we get to a sequence. Okay, here we go. A nice little sight. I'm surprised it's still so warm up here. All right, James, I'm in. Pomrov's coming down to meet you. Good, I'm heading through the gardens now. Turn on your tracker. I'll home in on your signal. Hang on. Okay, it's on. Okay, right. Make sure you keep Pomeroff busy. If he sees anything unusual, he'll lock down the casino. Understand? Don't worry, James. I know how to handle a man like Pomeroff. The fireworks are beautiful. There's a... S okay. It kinda, it's kind of hard to see with it being dark, but it looks like there was something up there. Here we go. Alpha teams are ready to start watch. 10 4. Charlie team standing down. Head open tonight. We've got orders to make sure we patrol the garden. Understood. Squad commander is ensure your team are in position. Hey Zaid, how's it going? Some drunk tourist who tries to sneak in here. Yes, sir. Let's go. Yeah. Finish your yeah. Yeah. Let's start your patrol. Sir. Okay, hang on. Drink. Thank you for that, Malik. I appreciate you, buddy. How are you doing? Do you think it has something to do with that Chinese guy he met with? I heard it Just like the original game did. Oh yeah? Problem. Physical addition. Yep, I did hear that. The catch with that though is that it is only for Investigating threat. It is only for the limited run releases. Excuse me while I disarm this guy, sir, and then I will shoot you. Thank you. But I want to see what those special editions are going to be. I want to pick up a special edition of that game. Uh, 
up from PSN and bought that and sold yours. Lost Ruins, you're going to have fun with that game. I actually did a run through, a playthrough of it. A playthrough of most of it on stream before. Okay. Soldiers looks great. I do want to try that game. Heroic was actually mentioning it to me last time, too, on stream. It's going all right, though, Zade. We're just rocking out to some Bloodstone here. We're doing a bonus James Bond game. There we go. Since it's the same series, right? I believe so it is. I haven't delved into that information, so I can't confirm confirm that, so. Before work and I had to stop myself because I was going in. What it, what is soldiers? Like James, for those that don't know. James, Comrov's still not here. What should I do if he doesn't show up? Stick to the plan, Nicole. Stay calm. We may just be late. It's critical that you make this work. Okay. I'll do my best. I've got to go. Don't remember this one from the Bond games. Yeah, this was this one's done by Bizarre Creations. This game actually came out in 2010. It was for 360, PS3, and PC. And there are some things I'm gonna mention after this game is over because this was the last thing Bizarre put out. And it makes me sad what happened to them. You get eyes on the boss's business associate? Yeah. I guess being a Russian billionaire has its ups. <laughs> There we go. Try and beat Hell in Hell mode in DNC5. How is that going so far? Well, actually, speaking of the Bond games, again, there is that 36, that Xbox achievements list going out in the wild again. I was talking about it with Shinky earlier in the stream. That it got shown again. Wario64 put out a Twitter, put that out on Twitter of the achievements for that. So do we, does that mean there's a GoldenEye remaster incoming? Because if so, I will extend the Bond playthroughs again. You'll get it, it'll come in time. Right? Because if it does, we'll do... I'll do Goldeneye. I said I would. Surprised he didn't get alert alerted. 
super characters. Only if need be. But Malik, what's your history with the Bond games? Keep Pomer off distracted while I find you. Okay, James, but wait, he's coming. Unlimited devil trigger meter. Is that going to be the only... Wait, how are the bullet holes in here? Oh, wait. I shot at that, but did it go through the door? Seven, you're going to need a key code to get past this door. It appears the code has been divided between three different guards in the casino. Each one has only a small piece of it. I'm marking their locations on your smartphone now. Scan their access cards to compile the full code and access the lift. Come on, come on up here. I don't want to kill this guy. One down, double O seven. But I guess I had no choice. I decided to have her try it. Is V her favorite character? Malik, how goes your shift, though? No, I'm not gonna shoot people down there yet. Oh, okay. I don't have to shoot them. I just got to get within range of it. Copy that. Now, this is a beautiful man I have to see before my night ends. I knew you were a secret agent of glory. I try, James. But how are you doing, dude? Welcome. I am trying my best to be a secret agent, but boy, is it. It's kind of tough. So I'm doing what I can. That's it, 007. You've got all the data necessary to access Pomerov's lift. I may have her play V's mission, so... She's the one that's going to have to take point on that, you would say? Oh, okay, there's something there. Well, no, James, what are you up to tonight? These are no job positions come to an end, so back on the job market till things pick up. What, what were you doing? Oh, no, wait, I remember. I was reading your tweets, my bad. I still, that still fucking sucks. I was gonna say, if you live near where I live, we could try and make something happen. But I think we live too far from each other. Sadly, sir. 
Otherwise, I'd, I'd have you out here. Man, it kicked my booty. Did you at least do the things? Because now all you can do is wait, right? Come on. It's far from all my besties. Yeah, I did it all and finally wait. The waiting game. Hopefully, it's not long, and it works in your favor. You can't hit a jackpot without putting down a few chips. No risk. Have you played this game though, out of curiosity? What's this? That is your golden ticket. Is this right? It is. Oh, oh. <coughs> what else do you need from me? Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. I'm pressing the wrong buttons. There we go. Got it. I haven't played many of those ones. What was the nature of this research? I told you. We were investigating anthrax and smallpox to come up with antidotes that could be used in the field in the case of a biological attack. And there was no way to militarize them? To turn them into weapons instead of cures? No. No? So why are these documents in code? I told you. I was working at home. What is the password for the USB drive? Tell me the key to crack the code. Stop. Stop. I'll tell you. Thank you. Part 2. I need to play through more of the DMC games. I've only played through 4 and DMC. I need to play through 5. Oh, we have company. Have you played GoldenEye 007, though? Also, don't mind my bad shooting. I sure have an adore it. Again, we may get a remaster, and if there is, and again, I'm just gonna keep saying it, if it does happen, I will play through both GoldenEye games on stream. Oh, crap. Well, that's the first time we've actually had Bond die in a shootout. Thankfully, loading is fast. I did crash a vehicle, though. The Last of Us. Okay, I hope you enjoy it. I did enjoy its story. Because that's the thing that drove that game for me. Oh, okay. But there are more people coming out. That opening is powerful, though. Where are you? I still need to play the sequel, though. I don't have part two yet. Get to the car. Bring it around to the front. What are you going to do? I'll see if I can tip the odds in our favor. Like I thought I would. Also, I've heard part two is long.
Come on, pop your head out. There we go. Oh, it arrived today. Did both of them or just one of them? But also, hey, Leafer, how you doing, dude? I hope you like... I'm, this is snacks and game. Okay. The game is a surprise. Also, have you had a chance to try out the snacks, like the drink and the chips? Just keep running at me, dude. Ketchup chips. Oh snap, Are, aren't those only in Canada? Yes, they are. And I'll say something about those ketchup chips. I am not a big fan of ketchup chips myself. But these ketchup chips, I... I am down with. I could I could eat them. Dude. What are you doing? Because I have to be up early and I have to go to the dentist. Do you have a dentist appointment tomorrow? James, I've got the car in front of the casino. Where are you? I'm on my way. Get ready to move. That's funny because I do as well. order the all dress chips uh I, i'm pretty sure there's got to be a shop where you can import that stuff right Are you just going to keep filtering guys to me? Because now I need ammo. Ooh. Damn it. New gun. Ooh. Where, 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 where? Thank you. Neither of our mouths are too fucked. I know mine's going to be pretty fucked. I'll say that. Yeah, no. The chips are actually pretty good. I was pleasantly surprised with them. Because also, like, here's the drink. I'll show, I'll show you games that I was talking about that I gave Leaper. It's actually a pretty good energy drink. Here, see if this is dry enough for you. What are you drinking? Same thing, straight. I was never one for girly drinks. Bond, are you there? Yes, Em. Right here. Nicole, do you mind a if ketchup and cheese fromage? This is a need to know. Of course. No problem. Hmm. I don't know. That could be an interesting combination. We can talk. What did you find out? We've translated all the documents you photographed in Pomarov's office this afternoon. It appears that most of them were invoices for highly sophisticated chemical manufacturing equipment. They were to be delivered to a defunct chemical refinery. He's recently brought back online in Siberia. Makes perfect sense. They tortured Tedworth, the researcher, for the code to his bio-research formulas. He was working on anthrax and smallpox antidotes for troops in the field, but they could just as easily be weaponized. That's what we're afraid of. No, that's what the whole world is afraid of. I still haven't tried to read those ketchup chips yet, so I can't speak if those are any good, Leifer. Perhaps Miss Hunter can help you facilitate this. Yes, I'll talk to her. Good. Good luck, 007. I need some energy in my You finished? I have to take a look at Pomerov's refinery in Siberia. Em thought you might be able to help facilitate this. Facilitate? I'm going to need a Definitely. flight, ground transportation, a local contact. And... Wait, wait, not so fast. 
I told Pomroff I'd get back to him about his business proposal. So it's the perfect cover to get the two of us into the refinery. The two of us? M said facilitate, not the company. Well, how do you hmm. think I'm going to get you to Siberia? Oh, let me guess. A friend of yours owns a plane? May I speak with Rudolph, please? Why am I not surprised? Jeez, James. You're going to love it. It's got a shower, a wine cellar, and the most unbelievable circular bed. Yes, I'll help. What? What's that look for? You'll be enjoying all that stuff alone. I'll be in the cockpit flying the plane. Okay, fine. Well, I guess we won't be able to hang out with this girl. Welcome to Siberia. Kind of your friend Rudolph to lend us his car. You sure he won't mind? He's got six of them. He won't miss it. <laughs> what else are you going to spend your money on up here? Aside from diamonds and wristwatches? I don't know. Sure there could be other things. I just can't believe Pomrov would be involved with Double shift snacks my way. He's always been like an uncle to You me. found one? Nice. What do they got for options? We can give you some we can give you some yes, pointers if you'd like. Good when you is on a new PC. That's actually something I'm gonna be doing for the fifth year anniversary. Actually, James. You really think they're going to believe that you're my bodyguard? I think they'd be more suspicious if you didn't. The game's interesting so far. It does yeah. feel like you're it's kinda standard third person shooter with some driving. The driving does Good. feel, I think, better well, in this than the other James Bond it. games we have played. It's still a little like floaty and loose. But it's fine. I'm here to I can see go with Stefan this one. Pomrov. Is he expecting you? Do you think I just dropped into Siberia? I also need somewhere for my bodyguard to wait, where he can be fed and watered. Park the car over there. And he can wait in the shed. Spasiba. I just noticed the title. Oh yeah? All right, I'm going to give you five minutes to get into Pomerov's office before I start causing trouble. I can live with that. That's Are we going to just blast this place up again? Yes? Sorry to interrupt, 007. We hacked into Pomerov's mainframe at the refinery and found Tedworth's research, but we were shut out before we could read it. You'll need to get to the server room and access it through the main terminal. I think we can be there. Can you send me directions? I'm marking the location on your phone now. Mm hmm I've been doing that for all of the James Bond games. Actually. So, if, I will say, if you guys have missed out on any of the other playthroughs, I do have them up on YouTube. Because the tires going to be much love, my friend. So good to see you. Good to see you as well, James. Go get some rest. Hopefully we get to chat some more soon. But take care of yourself. Let's see. But hey, at least you picked up on it. And since there will be more bond happening... We'll have to be sticking with the title. Hang on, I need to scan your car. Oh crap, wrong button. Come on. Come on. Remember when you gave me a ride and you spent two and a half hours stranded in the middle of nowhere. That was my There we go. So you spoke to me. But no leaf, are you up to anything tonight? Oh yeah? Nice. New friend? You'll probably play more prop hunt with them, right? Uh, no, I need to take a walk here, if you'll excuse me. Oh, 
At least an alarm doesn't go off. Just rest mostly. What time is your appointment? Down here? What? You mean you didn't hear what happened at the casino? No. Someone did it. Shot the place up. Way I heard it. He was after Pomerov's stuff. Some files or something. Ah, great. So now Pomerov's spook and got us all doing patrols. Okay, yeah, no. Oh, that's just unfortunate when a mic keeps cutting in and out. Excuse me, sir. Thank you for staying here. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Damn it, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Too early. There we go, we got it. Oh yeah? But I have to call other docs in the morning. Other doctor in the morning? Again, hopefully it's nothing too serious, dude. Search isn't here. You'll have to go to the main computer center. It's protected by biometric security measures, though. The only individual with security clearance currently in the building is Pomerov himself. Allergies. Okay. You may be able to get through if you can find sucks, fingerprints though. and a voice sample. So we gotta head back upstairs, I guess. Okay, he at least put the gun away, so... Yeah, so we have to go upstairs. This is the only way to get what we need. Enough pleasantries, my dear. You didn't fly halfway across the world to drink vodka. Tell me it was me proposal. I want to hear all about it. That's Pomerov's fingerprints. Now you just need to find a clear sample of Pomerov's voice. Again, follow the marker. Thanks for the lurk, Zade. I appreciate it. Stefan Pomerov, President and CEO. That's of Pomerov's Pomerov voice sample. Industry. You should be able to and access the computer center now. Marking location on your smartphone. Copy it. I'm on my way. Welcome, Mr. Pomerov. I like that how that guard just did not care. Alert, man. I want regular patrol. Something's going on today. We've got to keep the computer center secure. Understood. Who's 
Also, I will mention, like like I was saying, Leaper, this is normal difficulty, but it's a fair bit easy so far. Enter the computer center. Anyway, we just walk as normal. Seem to be holding for the moment. Good. That means we'll be able to build up to the final level. I'm gonna need your help with the HR5 compound raiding. Why? What are you doing with it? They want to try mixing it with the G6. There's the computer terminal down there. We need to get down there. There we go. Damn it! We thought we could get in without setting off the alarm. We need time to access the files. You've got to keep the phone in range. Do you think you can hold out? You'll be the first to know if I can't. Yeah, I'm going to die. There we go. Oh, damn it. I got stuck. Shit. Come on, stop it, stop it. Come on, get closer to the main terminal. There we go. That's the key. Because I have Andromeda as for the Xbox, and I'm just going to stick with the Xbox version. Oh, I got to use the terminal again. Okay. There we go. Bond here. Where are you, 007? Pomerov's refinery. It's worse than we suspected. He's built an entire bioweapons factory. He's churning out toxins by the ton. Can you destroy it? Let me get back to you on that.
Oh, go, 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 go. No, James. Oh wow, the screen's just becoming way more distorted. Oh, that was close. Siege? How are you doing? Feeling good for the first time in a while. That's good news, man. I'm glad to hear you're doing well. What are you up to, though, tonight? And I hope you keep those good vibes going. Probably. I'd be a little surprised if it didn't. We need to leave this place. It just depends if they're going to release it on their own or if they're going to get a party to do it for them. Zade is pretty close. Pretty close. Don't tell Cinematic, though, about that. You take a look at them. The rest of you, come with me. I figured if they're gonna do a physical release of it, they're gonna it's going to be the same idea. The same idea as Kina. Well that almost killed me. So I know what she generally looks like in each of the important pro still need to give her clothes and a costume, decide height and stuff, so more stuff to figure out, right? But no, the character's coming along nicely. Are you going to do a color sketch of Iris in the future? Because I remember you were defining her eye color as well, and I believe you defined what her hair color was too, right? Oh, that was delayed. I did one, but messes up on it. Well, hey, you still got... It's not going to be done immediately. It's You're you're still going through refinement purposes, so... I guess, what, still work on the, the black and white sketch first before proceeding? So it'll be a few months after the game initially drops. That's what I'm thinking. This control room coordinates the refinery's core systems. Access the central control panel, and I'll run a diagnostic. Well, I mean, if you don't feel comfortable with it yet, why not practice with Kasumi first? Since you like drawing her. From the 
and maybe Ukyo, like some other characters, because you know what their color profiles are. And then when you feel more comfortable with the color drawings of it, then you start to mess around with Iris, probably. That could be an idea. Which way? Okay, this way. Oh no, we can go either way, okay. We'll just go this way, because this is the way I thought of. We are not shooting civilians. Okay. Oh, hi. Excuse me, I was looking at my cell phone for directions. 007, the schematics show this route leads to the exhaust override. Lock the valve and cripple the refinery's heat extraction network. Not an idea on this intruder yet. Nothing. But it's suspicion that it's the same guy who worked over at Pomeroy's casino. But no one's been able to come up with a positive idea. Ah, uh, it doesn't. Be wow, he just fell off. But I will say, at least Leaper, since you have Andromeda, see, like, when the Legendary Edition goes on sale for a good price, pick that up and play through those two. Those are pretty important as well. You've done it, Bond. Now head to the coolant station and override the safety features. Okay. Give me some There we go. Oh, you just had to pop out, didn't you? Come on. There we go. Hey, Glenn, what's up? Bring in the hype as always, I see. Thank you for that. Well, we do get to see Bond shoot at people playing another Bond game, yep. We're doing a special request, and I will say Bond might be extended even further if that GoldenEye remaster is true. If it is, we're going to do Golden, the original GoldenEye remaster, and then we'll do Reloaded as well. Have you played Bloodstone, though, out of curiosity?
OLG GoldenEye greater than Reloaded. I figure that'll probably be the case. But I'm wanting to do it in the same way we did Metal Gear Solid and the Twin Snakes. You need more men? No, you don't. I have never played Bloodstone, so this is your first time looking at it. Bloodstone's not too bad. It does feel kind of by the numbers. I'll say that. But Bloodstone is actually pretty interesting. Bond, so why was this one a special system. request? It down, It'd be like, we finished it, I kind of felt like playing more. I just kind of felt like playing more James Bond. So. And there's also a special reason for this one too. as well like i said it's this game was done by bizarre bizarre creations which is a developer i like but this was bizarre's last game which is the thing that makes me sad What else had they done? They did Metropolis Street Racer for the Dreamcast, but they're mostly known for Project Gotham Racing. One through four. And they also did Blur and Geometry Wars. Where are you firing from? Oh, you're up there. I didn't know there was four of them. Yeah, there are there are four PGR games. I have all four PGR games. Is this like tied to Spectre and Vesper? This takes place between, I believe, Quantum of Solace and Spectre. So this is an original game. It's an original story, just like Everything or Nothing. And Nightfire and Agent Underfire, for instance. But the other things that are significant is because this game was published by Activision. As I said, this was bizarre, but the big thing is this is Bizarre's last game. And this game did not sell well. Bond, the coolant pipes have ruptured. Get out of there. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Since this was their last game, and like after this shift, not even like this shift in November, and within the same month. Activision shut down Bizarre Creations. I'm like, you guys, you guys suck. Why would you do that to these guys? Bond, you need to get out of that warehouse. I'm working on it. There we go. This doesn't even look like a bad game. It is by the numbers, I would say, for some of the stuff. But I'm I'm not saying I'm not having a bad time with it. I am enjoying it. Though. And I was amused. I haven't played this their other games though. Um they did do another shooter, which if I can find it if I can find it 
if if I have it in my collection somewhere, I'll try and find it, and we should do it on stream one night. They also did a shooter called the Club, and the Club was an interesting one because it kind of combined PGR Nicole? with a third-person shooter. Where are you? What's taking so long? Meet me outside with the car running as quickly as possible. I'm on my way. The break up Microsoft, they do this in every Warning, warning, help down. Well apparently I've heard at least stuff with Crash Bandicoot as well. There might be something happening with it. So we'll have to see if any of that is true. Daniel Craig and Awesome Bond. Nicole, where are you? I'm on my way. I'm on Just get here quickly. You're giving me a lot of ammo here. That means something is up. Could you hurry up? We have a situation here. Hang on, Zade. Luigi's blue ras ice blue raspberries. It's kind of sour. Is that a snack or a drink? Ammo refill equals boss fight. And this isn't a boss, this is just like wave encounter, survive. Essentially, right? I'm nearly there, Dad. Come on. Could you please hurry up? I feel like I'm getting my shit kicked in.
Hang on. You made me wait. There we go. Kind of both. Move over. I'll drive. Okay, here we go. Driving sequence again. Are you all right? Yeah, I think so. What happened to Pomerol? He ran off. I saw him get on the train that delivers the chemicals to the port. His men were loading them on. Which way? Over there. We've got to stop him before he gets those bioweapons out of the country. Hang on. All right, hang on. Are you mad? Like I said, this isn't all fun and games. When is it not? Gonna head out. Got an early day tomorrow. Okay, go get some rest, dude. Thank you for coming by, Glenn. I appreciate seeing you. Hopefully, we'll get to chat some more soon. Okay. You have a good night. You don't think so? Is there logistical issues with it? Well, okay, apparently the car crashed. Look, he's trying to get away. Fasten your seatbelt, we've got a train to catch. Feel like Frost from Rainbow Six would be a nice person. I mean she could be a nice person. I would hope she's a nice person. But, yeah, no, like I said, the driving feels much better in this. I think feels better in this game. Yeah, apparently. Don't worry, we'll just bounce off the tower. It's James, fine. What are you fine. doing? You're heading for the river. Hold on. Without a chase. I mean, for Bond games and even for movies, you need at least a vehicle sequence. There has to be at least some kind of vehicle sequence. Don't drop into the water. Like that. At least we don't have to start the whole thing again. Look, the train we can still catch it. I believe they are still a thing, right? Of course, there's a chopper. Watch out! Get your head down. So why would you stop the vehicle? Oh. I thought I was changing camera angles. Okay, so you can do a bumper view apparently. Okay, interesting. Watch out! Get your head down. You're telling me. It's a dead end. No, it's not. We're gonna get on the train tracks. There we go. Good enough. We crashed into the train. Unexpected expenses. Oh. Oh. 
Nicole. Are you all right? Oh, I think I broke my wrist. Here, let me see. This should work until we can get you to a doctor. You really did turn out to be my bodyguard. What was that? The train is stopping. We must be at the port. I've got to get off the Pomerol. Here, take this. Stay here. No, please. Take me with you. Can you handle it? Yes. Don't leave me here. Fine. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, so what's going to happen next? Start the engines and get us out of here. Now! Are we going to get on this plane? Set your heading for 220. But there are boats in the way. I don't care what's in the way. Plow through them. There, the hovercraft. When we get on board, do you think you can pilot it? Yes. But you've got to be careful, James. If you puncture one of those chemical johns with a bullet, the bioweapons will escape and kill everyone. Keep, keep that, that in mind. mind. We've picked up Bond's signal. It looks like they're on Pomeroff's tail. Acquiring visual now. Bond and Nicole are on an assault hovercraft with what appear to be multiple hostiles on board. Picking up audio now. I'll patch it in. I've got the throttle open all the way, but we're not catching up here. <coughs> All right, let's go wreck some fools, shall we? We need to catch up with that thing. I will say, we did have some minor issues at the start, at least getting things running, but you know what? It's been running fine so far. Would it be crazy if you could shoot somebody into one of those propellers? Maybe be a mean thing to do, but... It'd be fun. It'd also be a bloody mess. Right? Ten out of ten game if it did. That would make it that would make it a better James Bond game, but it'd also make it the bloodiest James Bond game. If it had like M rated execution kill. M rated kills like that, right? You need to get out of here. 
That's the kind of thing you'll find in Dead Space. I would hope to see that in Dead Space, but also something to see in the Callisto Protocol. I'm excited for that game to come out. James, we're speeding up. But he's still getting away. You have to dump more cargo. I ain't running in front of that thing. James, are you there? We're still too heavy. I'm working on it. There you go. Now we got rid of that other thing. James, that's great. You've done it. We're gaining on him. I'm heading back to the bridge. James, he's firing missiles. You say that like I should be surprised. At least I don't have to worry about overheating, it looks like. That's it, Nicole. Good. Now hold us steady. Nicole, can you get it onto the other side of the thing, please? There we go. Yo. See, I think those numbers can be higher for you, right? Okay. 
I think she said not to shoot the yeah, the containers. Now that's the adorable one you gotta work on. Games. Yeah, no, I don't shoot you, I shoot the red thing. Quite literally. Tell me, Captain, are you sure your men can handle this? The safe destruction of all those bioweapons? Bioweapons? What bioweapons? There are no bioweapons in Russia. I see. And those men on the boat, in the hazmat suits. That's the problem with you people in the West. You always think there are WMDs. Then you go to war over it, and then, poof, there are none. You know what kind of paperwork I would have to fill out if there were WMDs here? Clearly, my mistake. Yes. And in the meantime, you can expect my government to be calling your government to register a protest for your actions here. I wouldn't have expected anything less. James, are you all right? Better than you. Oh, this? It's given me an entirely new idea for a line of bracelets. Indeed. The cast will be off in a week. It's nothing that a few days at a private beach in Bermuda won't take care of. Care to join me? I've got a plane waiting. I wish I could. But I've still got some mopping up to do here. Hmm. You sure? We might be able to get into all sorts of interesting trouble together. Well, the offer's tempting. It sounds tempting. By the way, what about your friend? Isn't he going to be upset about destroying his car? <laughs> he probably expected it. He already thinks I'm a terrible driver. I wreck everyone I get into. Back in London, they say the same thing about me. Anyway. Mm -hmm. Congratulations on stopping Pomerov. Thank you. And thank you for helping me facilitate things. You sure I can't convince you to come with me? Positive. Well, I hope I get to see you again. I'm sure our paths will cross. Maybe yeah. sooner rather than later. Take care. I can't believe you let her go. She wanted you. I need a room. A private room. You should have asked for that while she was still here. Don't you have some cleaning up to do? Some non-existent bioweapons? Second floor of the police station. Third door on your right. And make sure you say hello to MI6 for me. I'll give them your best. You can't wait until that wrist is recovered. No, she wants it now. Bomb here. Yes. I've been waiting to hear from you, 007. Pomerov's dead. The factory is destroyed. The remaining bioweapons have been turned over to the Russians. I know. The Prime Minister has already heard from their government. It's threatening to become a diplomatic nightmare. I want you out of there. Back in London for a full debriefing. No. This isn't over. The anonymous tip we received about the bioweapons couldn't have been from the researcher. He was being tortured at the time. Somebody wanted us to get to Pomerov, and the question is who and why. So how do you want to proceed? When I took the courier's cell phone in Istanbul, all the phone calls on it were local except for one that he didn't answer. Have Tanner and Q Branch find that phone. I want to know who the courier was avoiding and why. Most of them have been pretty short, Leifer. Everything or Nothing was the longest one. Wait. Good morning. Colonel Ping. Good morning, Commander Bond. To what do I owe the pleasure of this phone call? I'd like to know why a top Chinese agent was trying to contact a courier in Istanbul. Perhaps it's the same reason a British agent was following him. Are you suggesting an alliance? You'll find me at the aquarium in Bangkok tomorrow night. 
come alone. It's the only way I can guarantee your safety. Funny. I was just going to issue the same warning to you. Okay, then. Bond here. Good evening, Mr. Bond. Where are you, Pig? We'll meet soon enough, but first, I need you to perform a small task in order to ensure our security. And what might that be? It's come to my attention there is recording equipment hidden in the aquarium. And we can't take the chance of anyone listening in on us. Let me know after you found them and disabled them. Okay, so that's one. We need to find more bugs. Okay. And I want to say it's that on the other side, too. Oh, come on. I'm pressing it too fast. There we go. We'll leave here. It's either too short or I'm going through this too fast. Tell me, Commander Bond, how much do you know about whales? Not much. Enough to know they shouldn't be kept in aquariums. Apart from that, I wouldn't like to end up in one. Then maybe you can understand what it's like to live inside the world's biggest country. There are 1.3 billion people living in China today, Mr. Bond. 1.3 billion Chinese who need to be fed and housed and clothed every day every week, year in, year out. I am aware of the numbers. But perhaps not the implications. Go on. It's not that we're not as smart or as technologically savvy as the West. We invented gunpowder and currency while you were still living in caves. But in every society, there are those who would cheat, those who would steal to gain any advantage. The researcher, industrial espionage. Someone in China was behind this. One of your people kidnapped and killed him. No, something worse. An economic mercenary. Someone who would steal the most dangerous technological secrets and sell them to the highest bidder. 
not out of ideology or politics, but for money and power to turn us against each other. But who? Where? How do we find him and stop him? My team was in Geneva, following up on a link to this man. Do you recognize him? No. His name is Rak. He was born in northern Mongolia, on the contested border between Russia and China, and has no love for either. He keeps his money and his mistress in Switzerland. But he operates out of Bangkok. If it's illegal, he's got a piece of it. At first, we thought he was a middleman in all this, but... Shit. Your support squad isn't pro, isn't protected from the so-called glorious headshots. Headshot, my only weakness. It is the only way. Your goggles cannot save you from that. Oh. Come on, pop your head out. I want this gun. I'm trying to do everything with every weapon. Even though my aiming is pretty bad. But we need to get that dude. Why? Who ordered this? Was it that guy in that photo?
drive carefully. This is not a game. But then again, we are playing a game. We're about to uncover that. That's what it seems like. Cannot get away. Oh, we could, that could have went bad. graphite pencils for years and have almost no experience with pencil crayons, so... It's kind of new territory, then, you would say, for you, right? So, if anything, it just comes with practice. Come on. Do you think he do you think James would give up that easily? No, I don't think so. an entire army, his own little mini army, and we just destroyed all of them. Stop! Take one more step and you're dead. Throw down the gun. No, just by talking to you, Rock is going to kill both of us! I don't think so. James?
Oh, I have an. I think he has an idea. There we go. So Rock ordered this. There we go. The driving is a little more tough, though, in this I'm finding, but it's still better than, as I said, the other one. but also causing this much destruction. It could be the sirens on on this truck too. Hopefully we'll be done with this. And the signs as well. But it's also the game is dark. It's quite a bit dark. Yeah, just destroy everything, dude. Also, the camera shaking isn't doing it any favors, let's be honest. Well, he just ran right through that. Will you just stop the truck, please? Just give me the info I want, then we can stop- you can stop wrecking this place. And 
he just magically got a speed boost. Well, that's probably enough damage, right? Get that body to the mog and find me the other driver. Bond. Good to see you're alive, 007. We tracked your cell phone to Bangkok. But the GPS coordinates haven't moved in six hours. I may be closing in on the people behind the researchers' kidnapping. I need to have Key Branch run a data check on a man named Rack. Banking, business associates. Have them contact me with names and addresses. Will do. But I should warn you. We've been following news reports that the Thai police are looking for an Englishman who destroyed half of Bangkok last night in a car chase. And what makes you think it was me? Do you really want me to answer that question? Can I call you back? There's still no sign of the second driver. Go check the buildings along the riverbank and see if anybody saw anything. Yeah, we're not gonna kill them. Bond, we've located a potential lead to Rack from an old friend of yours called Silk. He owns a club not far from you. I'm marking the location on your smartphone now. We've got men fetching the river. If he died in the crash, we'll find the body. Good. We'll be well paid if we find this guy. Have we completed a sweep of the riverbank? I've got men working on it, but it's going to take some time. Copy. Keep me updated. Here we go. Yep, okay, sweet. Do that. Well, hopefully this is easier on your eyes now. Okay, we've got CCTV stills of the suspect. This guy needs to be found. There are some very influential involved now. Search the area. We're being well paid to find this guy.
but I think I'm sensitive to brightness because of it always being so dark. You're, that could be be something if you're used to like dark settings when you go see the light. It's like, ah, my eyes, right? <laughs> Come closer, come closer, come closer. Maybe they're gonna use stealth take down there, interesting. Well, as long as you don't burn up in the sun like a vampire, then I think it's okay, Siege. Can I show you to a table? No. But you can okay. show me to the boss. He's behind there. My good man. Is there some way I can be of service? I'm looking for a man. What kind of man? Your kind of man. Someone who preys on the helpless, sees the world as corrupt, and wants a piece of it. <laughs> You know me too well, James. Unless you become immune to sunlight. How on earth did you find me? Well, if you turn over enough rocks and enough stickies, you're bound to be under one of them. You know they ran me out of Saigon. Was that after or before they ran you out of Athens? Or was it Ibiza? I lost track after Johannesburg. Can I interest you in a girl? I'll settle for some information. Same old James. But what makes you think I'm going to give up Rack without some kind of compensation? Because I know you, Silky. And I know that you don't care whether Rack lives or dies, but you wouldn't mind having the 20% back that he probably skims from this place every week. Rack has a secret boathouse on the Chow Pryor River. But I'll bet you won't make it there alive. I'll take the bet. Add it to what you owe me from last time. And good day to you too, <laughs> Could have had me told you, can I get you a girl? And he's gonna sell us out. There's an Englishman on his way to see Rack. My money says he won't make it. And you know how much I hate to lose my money. Don't let me down. Of course, I knew this would happen. I mean, it would be nice, but I mean... We gotta focus on business, man. We gotta focus on business, Siege. That's what we're here for. Girl can come later. Rack's got the police out looking for the British agent. But we've been told he'll be heading this way. Stay on your guard and be ready to fire. Rack doesn't care if he's dead. I was just like, why aren't you finishing?
interactive box on the way down. Yep, how long do you think the IO interactive bond game will be when it's... Like, in terms of how long it'll take to complete the game? Or how long do you think it'll be until it's released? How long it'll take to... I want to say it's... I want to say it's about as long... It's going to be as long as a Hitman game. Maybe... At least above 10 hours. Uh, they vary. But for me, it, like, I, I spend a little bit longer with some of the Hitman games. I haven't played through the new, the new ones, though, yet. I need to. But that's the thing I want to see with this new title. Is... Oh, ow. Is how much does it take from Hitman, or is it going to be kind of its own thing, like say Freedom Fighters? Because I really liked Freedom Fighters. That was a great game. I'm assuming you haven't played a Hitman game though before, Leafer. I've already used that weapon, though. Thank you for waiting. Okay. Dicked around with them at friends' places. I would say it'd be a good idea to play through one of them. Now you can't even dead.
Oh, someone for blind firing. He's the guy we need. And of course they won't let me shoot him. It's over, Rack. You're finished. I know about the kidnappings, the bioweapons, the missing researchers. Give you one last chance, Rack. You should have quit while you had the chance. You look away for one second, and then this kind of shit happens. Now we're gonna have to get ourselves out of being captured. Welcome to your final destination, Mr. Bond. You're in Burma. Your last stop. The end of the line. The place where your sad story comes to an ugly end. So how does it work, Rack? What do you do? Fly your kidnapped victims here and torture them until they give up their corporate secrets? Take a very good look at this knife, Mr. Bond. It's platinum, encrusted with precious stones and diamonds, designed to elicit the most exquisite pain when I use it to eviscerate a man and skin him alive. You talk, Mr. Bond. You give up your secrets. Sooner or later, they all do. You could kill me, Rack. But MI6 will send somebody else. Either way, you're as good as dead right now. I wouldn't answer that if I were you. Wait. I'll be there as soon as I can. Get my helicopter ready. We're going to Bangkok. When I return, Mr. Bond. We're going to string you up in the yard and bring all the prisoners around to watch. After they see me cut your tongue out, it may help loosen theirs. So you think. There we go. Thank you for that. That's what I thought. We need to go back down there. Access granted. Okay, here we go.
I wanted you to slide behind the other thing, James. Jeez. I'm a bad agent. You just watch your buddies die and you're still gonna come up here. Thank you. Hey, Mr. Bongo, how's it going? Uh, we could try and do some... Maybe next weekend or something. Or if I do have some time this week, maybe we'll do some, okay? I'd be down to play more Thoreau. Like I said, we're just rocking out to this. What are you up to tonight? Anything special? Hey, you come here. Scan that, there we go. Take your shot. Moving up. Deal with this guy. Keep firing. Moving up, covering fire. Nothing special. Yeah, don't worry. You're not missing too much here either. I am just trying to do well. You're pretty much done with your decluttering stuff.
Oh, I'll take this. This way. Oh, crap. Apparently I found ammo for this thing. Oh, they do have ammo for this thing. Ouch. Ouch. I thought that was explosive because it's red. This thing is pretty much one shot, one kill. Almost. See. I feel like I'm getting addicted to decluttering. The Salvation Army, oh yeah? How was he aiming? Come on. That combat rifle is pretty OP, but... Which is why we're gonna stick with it. There's a plane. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna borrow this for a little bit, guys.
Do I get the shoot out of this thing or no? Oh shit, they have guns. Of course they have guns. What am I thinking? Please tell me at least I have guns I can use. Out of my way. The guy really appreciated those jackets. He probably did. So much for catching up. Dramatic. Let's go, James. Do you? Not really. Oh, she said thank you multiple times. Well, at least, you know, they're grateful. And it was a nice thing to do. Surprise I'm not dead. Yeah, James should have been dead by now.
feel like I'm missing something. You're gonna go ahead to sleep? Okay, thanks for hanging out with us, Leafer, though. Gotta restart from the checkpoint. I am missing something here. I have to get up there somehow. The question is how, though. Oh, there's a button. It didn't seem very clear that there was a button there, did it? Use the mouse to move the crane up and down. Oh, there we go. Use W and S. See if we can get some information then. Revised brochures for reprint. So you managed to get those errors fixed? Nice, so... Gonna be all good to go now, then. They recommended, yeah. Because that was also something else that pointed that was pointed out as well, right?
you run into issues, yeah. But hey, as long as the issues are pointed out and can be fixed... Oh, physics. people are you willing to send out? Oh, jeez. Came up from behind. Oh, well, that's fine. Not a big deal. Uh, okay, there we go. Feel like he's hanging. But I mean, every every day is just a learning process, right? And the more you do it, the better you get at it, hopefully. That is the plan. Okay, of course, another sniper.
they're just gonna keep coming by the looks of it. When I first designed the brochure, yeah. At least doing revisions are normally easier than designing the whole thing from the start. It's not like they ask you to redo everything, right? Because then that would just be a real war. That'd be a lot more work than what it should be. Well, now they have the same weapons, so... Stand your ground. Do you know how easy it has been to track you? The death and destruction you leave in your wake. You've led us all around the world. Mr. Bond, I have 200 men in this dam. The longer it takes for them to capture you, hey, Munchy, how's it going? the slower I will make your agonizing death. What do you mean to do if you reach me? I beat you once before, Mr. Boss. Meh, same. I'll happily do it again. Just, you know, trying to chill and rock out to this. You up to anything, though, tonight? All we're just doing is leaving death in our wake. You could say. Because Bond is just going on a murder spree. And laughing at stupid shit. Hey, I mean, hey, something you gotta, you gotta keep yourself amused somehow, right? No, 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 James, 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 bad, 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 bad. James, come on. I love when they randomly ragdoll. Yeah, it's hilarious, isn't it? He just keeps running for the cover. Goods. Are you running out?
Crap, crap, crap. I think this should be good. Probably gonna be food shortages, yeah. Seems like, but the way things are going, now that you mention it, it seems to be heading to that point. Especially with like gas prices. Has been stocking up too, yeah. You can never be too certain. Hang on. There you are. You cannot escape. Might as well, let's just like go back to using a bike. Because it's basically just gouging at this point now, right? I don't want to die yet. He's still here. Your chance, Rack. Please, save me. I'll tell you everything. I'll tell you who I'm working with. Too late. I already know. Mm hmm. Uh.
The company had sales of 8.4 million euros last year. The owner, a British industrialist named Simon Porter, has developed a proprietary solar panel technology using a new kind of monocrystalline silicon wafer enhanced with copper indium diselenide to bring the cost of electricity down to less than one euro per kilowatt hour. Hmm. Interesting. Have we inquired whether there's a market for this technology? Our contacts in North Korea have already said they'd pay handsomely for it. And Mr. Porter? He lives in London. Yes. But you should be aware that the Ministry of Defense has expressed interest in the company. It's looking Korea good right now. I don't know. I don't think that beach state's going to happen now. I appreciate your concern, but I don't think MI6 is going to be a problem anymore. Yes? This just came for you. Thank you. So then, we are all agreed that he's our next target. What is it? Is something wrong? No. Nothing. I have to leave. The meeting is adjourned. He's been playing everyone. He's been playing us from the start. And where do you think you're going? Just come back. I want to talk to you for a minute. I need to ask you something. Slow down, slow down, please. Nicole, please come back. It's nothing personal, it's just business. Of course that had to happen, right? Okay, at least this time I didn't hit that thing. I don't know, Siege, you still want to go for that beach day? Nah, I'm good. Okay. No, nah, I mean, but, I mean, we should stop her, though. She needs to be... Oh, son of a... This time, hug the right. I like her better looking for some physio for her wrist. I mean, yeah, that was probably the best moment, but 
knowing who that she's behind this like nah she needs to be stopped she needs to be taken out or taken down sorry I don't know if I don't know if she dies or not but we'll have to see Nicole, stop. Don't move. Hello, James. Fancy meeting like this? Drop the gun. Move away from the railing. Nicole, drop the gun! Or what? You'll shoot me? I'd prefer to bring you back alive, but it makes no difference to me. When did you figure it out? That's not important. I want to know why. Why'd you why do it? Why did you do it? There was a man. A rich and powerful man. I would have done anything for him. He asked me to help him. At first, it was innocent. And then? I thought I could prove myself by destroying Pomerov's operation. And you did it for love? No. You of all people should know. I didn't want to grow old, alone, and poor. Who? Who is it? It won't make a difference. I want a name. You don't understand. He's everywhere. He's bigger than you. Bigger than MI6, bigger than everything. And he's watching us, right now. There is no escape. Nicole, down! Get down! Bond? Are you there? Come in, 007. Are you there? Yes, I'm here. We've been concerned about you, 007. What happened? I'm fine, Em. But I think you're gonna need a new contact in Monaco. Mm -hmm. If you need me, you know how to reach me. Bond out. I have to see where this takes place, though, again. Because I think I said it was between Quantum of Solace and Sky... and Spectre, but I think it might be between Skyfall. I'll have to take a look again, though. Or if this is just completely original in and of itself, but... Alright then, I guess that's it. So no, I pour one out for... For Bizarre. This was their last game. And then... They got shut down. I did enjoy this. This game was actually pretty good. It did feel a little formulaic and stuff, but I think it probably would be a little more difficult on the higher on the higher settings. But for default difficulty, majority of it felt quite a bit easy. But no, this game was actually good. Rip. Yep. So no, we'll let the credits roll. But hey, that's another Bond game done. So we'll have to see if that rumor or that leak for the Xbox achievements for a GoldenEye remaster is happening. Because as I said, if it is, we'll play through that remaster and I'll also still do GoldenEye Reloaded. That's why I never got any more PGR. Yeah, it was after this game and it was shortly after this game launched, Activision closed their doors. But apparently, I did a little reading into this, and there was going to be a sequel 
a sequel to this that was being developed by Raven Software. But it was in like pre-production phases. And because this game did not sell well, that that sequel got scrapped. Otherwise, yeah, we would have had a Raven Software take on James Bond. I would have actually really liked to see that. Yeah, they will say with this, like, there is there is stuff here. This was it had its moments. This game did have its moments, and it was pretty intriguing with what was going on with it. But this is definitely one of the shorter James Bond games, though, for sure. But yeah, no, that's why, well, it's just after PGR4, yeah, after PGR4, they went to Activision. But Microsoft still retains the PGR, the PGR name and the IP. Because all act all Bizarre did under Activision was Blur and Bloodstone. So this game. I think some of these guys did form some of the team did leave like once it was shut down they made playground games so i think some of bizarre still exists in the form of playground so that's why we have four, the forza horizon games because forza horizon kind of gives off some pgr vibes but you know what i'll do i'll take a look around i may have a copy of the club if I do, maybe we'll boot it up. We'll boot it up one night. Take a look at that game, see what it's about. Because the club was an interesting title. As I said, it, it reminds me of Project Gotham Racing with a shooter. So it plays like a third-person shooter like this. But you're basically trying to go through the levels and go for go for score, go for points. Do you own any of the PGR games, though, Siege? <laughs> yeah, so that's why, like, the club is a interesting title, definitely. Because the other thing with the club is that it was also 360, PS3, and PC. I gave a buddy my old Xbox. Yeah, as I said, I think I, I believe I have all four PGR games. But I think I just have the discs for PGR1 and PGR2. I don't have the cases or anything for them. I have it for PGR3 and PGR4. But I should take a look at those games again, because I did like PGR2. That game was great. I didn't play a lot of, of the fourth one, though. And I tried a tiny bit of 3. The thing I remember with 3 was that it was a launch game for the 360. And I believe 1, the first Project Gotham, was a launch game for the original Xbox. But yeah, Project Gotham was my first introduction to Bizarre Creations. I want to see if I actually want to see if the PGR games still hold up. But if we do, like I'll try and see maybe load up two or load up four. I wonder if the games are on the back and pat list. TLDR is he had to move and his roommates to all of his shit. So I gave him my old Xbox at the time. I had like thirty games. Well, fuck that roommate. <laughs> For stealing his stuff. That ain't freaking cool. Alright, I'll hydrate.
Thank you for that, Malik. I appreciate it. <sighs> How goes your shift, though, so far? Another Bond game down, yep. Another Bond game down, another single run. Complete. Oh no, I did enjoy Bloodstone. It, it was surprisingly entertaining. I'd be curious to see how it does play on a console, though. Did I tell you to hydrate and stretch? Yeah, if you didn't be like, you do it. Do it. You need it. Right? But yeah, I'm gonna. We're gonna see if those Golden Eye. If that Golden Eye remake remaster is true, we'll find out. Hopefully. Maybe at the latest would be the Xbox at the Xbox and Bethesda showcase. Who is your favorite Bond actor? I'm gonna be biased here. It's Pierce Brosnan just because he was the first one I saw as James Bond. I I actually do like Daniel Craig. He does a good job, and the three movies I saw with Sean Connery were also very good. I haven't seen any of the Roger Moore or Timothy Dalton ones, though, yet. And a Resident Evil director's cut. <laughs> For two games? All those, all that you had, that's... I don't know if that was a good deal, Siege. That doesn't really seem like a good deal. Yeah, they all did they all did a good job, but like I said, I can't speak for Roger Moore or Timothy Dalton yet, but like I said, I'll be biased and say and say Pierce Brosnan, but I think Craig has done a good job with his role. But Connery's the OG. He is the original. Oh, bad. I mean, I feel bad for you after hearing that. It'd be like, really? Not cool. Which ones did Timothy Dalton do, though? Well, what about you, Mr. Vongo? Who's your favorite Bond actor? And then, yeah, their localization, so all in different languages. But yeah, no, I would say if since if this is the game that Bizarre has to go out on, I mean, it's not a high note, but it's still a damn good time. It was still fun. I I would actually play this one again for sure. It's a fun little romp for a James Bond, for a James Bond experience. But yeah, shift is fine, just quiet. Well, at least that's a good thing. It's nothing too hectic or crazy. But I am curious to see what IO does with with this. I don't know if we're gonna see anything on it this year though. If they do do something with it, that would be pretty awesome. If they do show something this year for for James Bond. You know we're going to have to talk about it. 
but I will be playing. I will play that new James Bond game that they put out. Well, you even have access to achievements here, so. Only cost fifty dollars too, but back into. Thankfully, Xbox games are getting cheap. Orta was a classic. I have that game. I actually have a physical copy of that game. Panzer Dragoon Orta was good. I actually picked up the Panzer Dragoon remake. I actually picked up the Panzer Dragoon remake for the Switch. So I am actually going to give that game a run. I think I tried it just to quickly see if it works. You surprised me with the Togi with the Demons. I will actually... I want to go back and play and finish that game, and I want to play through Otogi 2 Immortal Warriors, so... The plan was, after we finish James Bond and everything, that we go do... That we actually go do the Otogi games. But if they're going to do more Bond stuff, like, again, like I said, if that GoldenEye remaster happens, then we're extending Bonds, the Bond games a bit longer until that and Reloaded are done. Then after that, we can go back to Atogi, or I might set Atogi for another day in the week. We'll have to see. We'll have to see what's up with that. I never played a lot of Mech Assault, but I know that game was a big one for online. I mean, a big one for me on favorite game for the original Xbox was Star Wars Night to the Old Republic. That that was one game I put a lot of time into. Same thing with... Conquer Live and Reloaded. Since I never played the original due to Order being my first Panzer game. Yeah, Orta was my first Panzer Dragoon game. You can actually unlock the original Panzer Dragoon in Orta as well. But I picked up the remake because the remake was like super cheap for Switch. You have a Switch, I believe, right, Malik? Bone Wars and Tetris. My Xbox came with uh, Sega GT 2002 and Jet Set Radio Future, and I put a lot of time into both of those games. I still have that collection, too. I, I will never get rid of it. Because Jet Set Radio has probably one of the best soundtracks I've heard in a game. You're kidding me. Oh, you didn't know about that unlock? Yeah, no, I what I remember was you can unlock the original Panda Dragoon in Orta. I believe you have to finish the game. You have to finish the game, I remember that. To get it. I'm gonna just look that up actually quickly. Yeah, so, yeah, so, okay, so I was right about that. So, no, you can unlock the original Panzer Dra Dragoon. The, according to this, it's, you have to finish the game. You just have to finish the game, or it says play a total of five hours, apparently. Because I did finish Orta. I finished it a few times. Yeah, it was made by M2, so it's basically a perfect remaster to Panzer Dragoon on Orta. Yeah, so, and Orta is back compat on the Xbox, and I believe it is Xbox One X Enhanced 2. Actually, if we want to talk about more, if you want to talk about more doing for original Xbox stuff, you guys want me to pop in, pop in that game? We can do a run of it one night. Would that be something you guys would like to see? As I said, I still have my copy. 
The only thing is, if I play, if I play Orta, should we play it on the original Xbox or? I could stream it from the Series X, from the Series X. I would just have to stream directly from the system, so you wouldn't get face cam or anything of that nature. That's the only thing. I'll just have to decide when it comes to that. But yeah, I'll, I'll dig out my copy. But before that, <clears throat> we'll have to go through these first because I want to finish those. We're going to finish these, and then we can get to that, but again, if there's more Bond, we got to go through more Bond, right? I'm actually going to check something on Bloodstone quickly. So, okay, so yeah, no, I was, so I, I, I screwed up because I didn't remember the order of the James Bond movies that Craig worked on. So this game is set, Bloodstone is set between Quantum of Solace and Skyfall. That was on top of the dragon. Yeah, no, her design was real good. Like, the thing that struck me with that game was that it just looked amazing. And, like, that was done by Smilebit, and that was actually a developer I used to follow whenever they did releases. So I have, I believe, their three releases they did for the original Xbox. Yeah, Smilebit. Yeah, because what Smilebit did, at least what I remember for the original Xbox, they did do Jet Set Radio Future, Panzer Dragoon Orta. I didn't know they actually did the House of the Dead 3. So, I do have a few of their games. But I think we'll wrap it up there for now. We've gone on for a little bit, but we should be back again tomorrow for Ken. But hey, another James Bond game down. Thank you all for coming by. It was fun. Hopefully you guys had a good time with this. I found it my local video video king during their bankruptcy sale and I saw the girl in the dragon. Oh yeah? Nice, nice find. Hold on. is let's do this person the thing yeah when i got my copy of that game i uh, i remember it at costco they were actually selling it for like 30 bucks at the time and I'm, i was asking my parents can we please buy this can you please buy this i really want to play this and i played that game so many times the only sad part with that game was that it eventually has to end i wish it kept going i it was just a blast I think that one's worth a revisit, though, for sure. I do want to know who's playing the next James Bond. I'd be curious to see who they pick for that role. Hopefully we don't have to wait too long to find out that information, though, Mr. Bongo, right? Let me see something, okay? Well, they're online right now. Let's go give them a raid. So, guys, if you want to catch up on any of the other James Bond playthroughs, I do have them up on YouTube. And then also stay tuned to the Twitters so you can stay updated on that kind of stuff. I normally try to keep updates if there's any changes to scheduling or just, you know, random thoughts. But everybody, thank you all for coming. It's been a blast. You are all amazing. And until next time, I will see you in the next stream.